Hi, I'm Brandy. This is Hound Dog Hollow, and today I'm going to be opening my December 2019 Witchcraft Way Box. Um, so let's get started. Let's grab Boo Boo's. It's got a really nice two sided um, insert. A Yule ritual, looks like. Nice bubbles. Ooh, pretty, pretty. Moon Winter Solstice Bath Shot. Ingredients. Himalaya salt, rock, black lava salt, dried calendula, cranberries, mugwort, orange, elderberries, myrrh, essential mm -hmm. oil, frankincense, and wild orange. Let's smell this because it probably smells amazing. It looks really pretty. Very, very cute. Ooh. Ooh, it smell it does smell wonderful. Let me get those colendo back in there. Very pretty. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Nectar Apothecary Mulling Spice. Word. Very classy. Love the container. Um, try your favorite beverage with these rich, festive flavors. Um, yum. Organic cinnamon, cardamom, and organic clove. Let's give this a sniff. Ooh. Oh, Lord, have mercy. <laughs> I can't. My love. <laughs> Beautiful. Mmm, and it smells like heaven. Oh, my God. It smells so good. Ooh, Earthen Alchemy Cleanse Loose Incense, Sage, Cedar, Rosemary, Juniper Berry, and Resin. This is another type of container that's hard for me to open without gripping. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Mmm. Mmm, it's good. It smells good. Slight though. Smelling salt. Mmm. Night Wander, Lavender, and Sandalwood. So, <laughs> when I hear smelling salts, I think of the little things that they had for women to stop fainting back in the day. The kosher star, Obsum star, Lavender, Jasmine, Sandalwood, Lavender. Shake container to release dormant aromas. Open container, hold it underneath your nose, and swirl it in circles to release the scent. Close your eyes, focus your intention, and take deep. Three deep breaths. Keep nearby to use when needed. All right. Yeah, sounds nice. That's very interesting. I've never gotten anything like this, so that's pretty cool. Very interesting idea. Well, well, don't you start. Cute little selenite tower. Pretty pretty. And it looks like I got an oil. The Rustic Apothecary Wonderland. So I'm definitely seeing lots of lavender buds. I love when it has a lot of um, solid components. Let me give her a sniff. Oh man, I'm messing this up. I'm messing it up. Oh Lord, have mercy. Ooh, it smells good. I, I lifted it up for you to sniff like you could. <laughs> And last but not least, a book. And so what I like about this is that literally I had this book in my Amazon cart until I accidentally saw somebody else. This is, um, or no, I saw their spoiler. So I took it out of my Amazon cart before somebody could buy it for me <laughs> for Christmas. And uh, here it is. Very cool. It is pretty rare that I get a book that I already wanted for myself. And so so practical you refer to it from years to come. I've never gotten this one. Um, you may or may not know that I get the Llewellyn series, like Herbal, Moon, Sabbath, Magical Almanac, and the Witch's Almanac every year. Um, I used to get the, I had a collection when I was younger, but then between moving so much in the military, I lost quite, I lost everything. I lost everything. <clears throat> but, um, I'm amassing another collection. I feel like there's a lot of good wisdom in there. I personally can go back and read them over and over again, and I have. 
uh, the wisdom doesn't go away because the year is different. So it looks really, really freaking beautiful. I am super, super psyched about, super psyched about this. Very psyched. I should do a review of Almanacs, but I'm getting like seven over the course of the thing. Let's check this out. Um, a Yule Ritual. Warming Mold Cider Recipe. December brings with it a celebration of a new hope as the longest night of the year. The winter solstice elapses and begins to give way to the strengthening of the sun and the return of the light. Many witches celebrate Yule around December 21st, and you'll find this box full of useful items for the long nights, traditional rituals, and quiet introspection that December is perfect for. The Practical Witch's Almanac. No matter what your path may be, this almanac has all the goodies uh, you are looking for to help you explore new ideas and to forge your own new, unique path as a witch in the new year and beyond. Mulling Spice. Um... Wonderland Oil is a spicy citrus floral body and ritual oil that lightens up the mind. Uh, cleanse Loose Incense Blend. Night Wander Smelling Salts. Midwinter Solstice Bath Shot and a Selenite Tower. Um, so let me say that um, again I am struck by how um, simple but simple, practical and useful every item in the boxes. These are literally um, all items that I will keep and use for myself. Um, so that says a lot. Um, it doesn't have, hmm, it has, it definitely has a, everything here speaks of December. So it definitely has cohesion and, and, uh, a definite, um, uh, theme this month. As opposed to last month, I was a little confused what the theme was. Um, but still, I loved all the items last month as well. So I'm, I really like this box. I am going to stick with it for... Oh, this is only my second one. So, you know, I will tell you how I feel about it after the third. Uh, but so far, so good. I really like all the items. Practical, useful, quality. So I'm going to keep doing it. Um, pretty please. So this was the Witchcraft Way, uh, December uh, 2019. I'm really especially psyched about the book, but Lord knows I could use Mulling Spice all the day long. I'm getting more into Loose Incense. I love Bath anything, and this one looks just so delicious and yummy. This is really interesting, and I'm going to think more about how I'm going to use that. And then I've got to find a way to smell this a little bit better. But I'm also a little stuffy today. So, love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will check you out soon. Bye!